Hi everyone in the Wellness Universe, it's Stephen Aitchison here. I think Sheila gave a great tip um, about embedding Facebook links into your posts and I want to give you a visual representation of exactly how to do that. There's one important thing we have to remember here is the size of the image that's going to be put in the link and I'll show you what I mean here. So I've got a, a post here that we can link in. And you'll see that's linking to a blog post I've got. And that image there is pulled straight from the blog post. Now what you've got to remember is the images have to be 600 by 327 to get this size of image. Or 1200 by 654. Um, better with 600 by 327, but you can double up or treble up or whatever. And Facebook will automatically format it to this size. Um, so I'll show you what happens if you don't do that and what you can do about it as well. So I've got another post here that doesn't have the formatted image. Okay, so if your image is not formatted correctly um, from the, the website or the blog post or wherever you're pulling it from, this is what you're going to see or this is what your readers will see. But what you can do is upload an image and I'll just upload any, any image that formatted 600 by 327 and this is what would happen so you can see it's much more visually appealing on the post itself when you've got the larger image and the writing underneath the description underneath and in the title underneath as well so what we would do here what she was talking about is to take the link out now you can leave that there and that's going to be clickable when you actually post it, but if you say something like um, how to develop a thick skin and that will give something for your readers to look at straight away and they'll see what it's about and then they can click on the image. Now we'll see what happens here. I'll just schedule this for 3pm and you can see exactly how it's going to look when you post it at 3pm. Okay, so this is how your post is going to look. So it's got a title up there. You don't need to have the title. I always find it better if you ask a question to your readers. So they're going to give you, you're going to get more comments that way. So if you ask a question, then it's going to be much better for you as well. A question pertaining to um, the link that you're putting up. But this is what happens. It's, this is a clickable image now. If we click that, you'll see it goes straight over to the blog post or the link that you've got in. So I hope that helps. I just want to give you a visual representation because that was a great tip from Sheila. Um, so I hope that helps you. Take care.